one news. 815, welcome back. A local brewery has produced a beer that's getting national honors. This is cool. Seedstock Brewery's Dusseldorf Alt was named the third best beer on Beer Connoisseur's Top 100 Beers of 2018. That's we had, a pretty awesome list to be on. We had the guy whose last name is Yunky Dusseldorf. do that because there was no <laughs> way I was going to do it. Uh, the brewery's Oktoberfest uh, was named the 33rd best beer in the world uh, 2018. The Old World Brewery, I should say, uh, is Denver's only base brewery to grace the list, which includes domestic, international. I mean, there's a big list. Uh, yeah. Is it truly worldwide? It's, it's global, yeah, yeah. I think the number one beer in the world is from Germany. I couldn't pronounce uh, that one. Well, it's nice to, <laughs> nice to compete with that, though. This yeah, is right? Ron yeah. Abbott, by the way, from Seedstock. So uh, you've got some beers here. Mm -hmm. First, can we pour? Can we just get to pouring yeah, already? So let's, let's do that. <laughs> let's do that. So tell us about this beer, and, and is it a, a traditional beer? It's a very traditional beer um, uh, from uh, Dusseldorf, Germany, and it's known for being very malty and very hoppy at the same time, which makes it which makes it a little more interesting. And this was, yeah, it was rated the third best beer by Beer Connoisseur Magazine. That's awesome. And our Oktoberfest was ranked the 33rd right. best beer Greg by said he wanted to drink out of the crowd. Yeah, I'll yeah, drink out of the growler, but I'm unsophisticated. Cheers. Congratulations. Best Thank beer, you. and I'm just, you know, hammering out of a can. It's fine. Don't worry about me. Uh, now, now, do you brew these in kind of the German style where you're doing the purity laws or are you doing an American twist on it? We do. It's it's very traditional. Um, Rhein Heichsgebot, I think, is the German <laughs> purity law. I, I'm not sure if I'm even saying that right. Close, close enough. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're not militant about that. We yep. don't follow specifically but we um, we tend to really simple you know we love simple things yeah. um, seed stock is an old farming term you um, harvested grains and then you set some aside to replant for right. next year mm -hmm. and so when my um, ancestors immigrated from the Czech Republic 150 years ago yeah. like the first thing they did is set up breweries in their barns oh, wow. and oh, the, wow. the beers that we brew are a real tip of the cap back to them basically cool. so yeah we, we keep it real simple did you stuff. submit for this uh, list or do they just kind of go around and try to figure out what the good beers are you know they reached out to us and asked if we would send a you know uh, send a couple of beers and they like, specifically sure. requested our <laughs> alt um, and our October fest and they heard yeah they heard it was good so, so uh, tell us good. where <laughs> you guys are so people can go find this awesome thank beer. you Thank you. We're on uh, uh, West Colfax at Lowell in the Sloan's Lake neighborhood, um, just about a half mile west of the Broncos football stadium. Yeah, it's basically right there next to Mile it, High. It is. It uh, is. Stone's throw Broncos away. football stadium. Is yeah. this like a landmark? I should know this. Yeah, no, it, yeah. <laughs> they, they, they do something there. It's the soccer. lights will guide you. Uh, well, not win not this year, but maybe next year. <laughs> next year. Thank next you next year. so much. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. Delicious. Yeah. Thank congratulations. You. Thank you. Thanks a lot. All right, let's get over to traffic now. Sam is watching the roads out there. What's up? Yep, we just have a couple of uh, sort of minor 